What's happening guys? Welcome back to the channel. I know, I know. It's been almost two weeks. I didn't have nothing last week. But that's because I was sick. I could even hardly talk. So, and I was waiting on something to come in. So, we've got a little special something, something for the CF Moto. And it pretty much consists of getting rid of that muffler on the back. Now if I could do this quietly. I'm just gonna break stuff. We're gonna put this exhaust on. It's just a slip on. And it's pretty much gonna be wide open. So let's get into it. I'm gonna walk you through it. And then I'm gonna tell you where you can find it. Because well, you've probably already read the title of the of the video because on Amazon it's only 50 bucks so let's get into it get this thing tore apart okay so before we get into this let's let you hear what it sounds like before Quick few little revs. So, let's get this exhaust on. See what it sounds like. Because I'm kind of scared. But hey, we'll give it a shot. Alright guys, we just got two bolts here. We got one here, one up underneath this shield. You can see it right there. That's going to take that clamp off, then we can get this off. Trying to make this where y'all can see it. Oh, there's a nut on the back side. Let me grab my wrench. Should we just do that in a second? That one's off. Then voila, that quick and simple. Now let's do some test fit and get the other one on. All right, guys, I had to cut the little adapter. We're gonna get this new bolt in, hang it. So I'll hang it there for a second. Hopefully those are 13s, I didn't even check. No, they look more like 14s. That's all right, we'll get to the 14 and Get a wrench and I had to grab a tin while I was in the shop and I forgot it too. So, a little modification, nothing too major. And I am having to use this little bracket, which is fine. You gotta do what you gotta do to get it to work. So let me run down and get a 10 and a 14 and I'll be right back. All right guys, here's a finished product. And let me tell you, 
It was a nightmare to get that on. The adapter piece is too small for the pipe, so I had to cut a piece of it off to get it to slide on. Then, my buddy Anthony came over to help me with it. Um, he told me to cut slits in it, going long ways, into the pipe. We slid that on with the factory clamp off the original uh, muffler, tightened it up, got it to where it would tighten down, then slid that exhaust pipe on, um, tightened it up, and boom, it's done. Now, I didn't film everything. At first, I didn't think I was gonna be able to do it at all. We did have to use the adapter piece here, right here. But, let me give you guys a little listen. So, Much better, much better, much better. The bike didn't sound bad with the stock exhaust. And it gets little pops every once in a while when you're downshifting or rev matching it. So it don't sound bad, but man, that looks so much better. So much better. Now I'm thinking taking some high heat red paint and going around the tips where it's silver to help blend in with the rest of the bike and of course my new Rorock Atlas 4.0 Batman helmet which matches the bike as well that will kind of tie everything up. Um, coming soon, the rear tidy kit or the rear fender delete is coming in. I'll shoot a video on that. I got one that retains the factory blinkers since they're LED, there's no sense in changing those. Um, that's coming soon next week. You can't really see Cliff sitting out there. You'll get a video on a new product that uh, we're going to be pushing on this channel. So you'll get that next week. And once again, sorry about last week not having a video. I was sick. I planned on doing the uh, video on Cliff, but didn't have much of a voice. So that being said, guys, if you're interested in this exhaust, this slip on exhaust check the link down below I got a link over to Amazon 50 bucks like I said 53 dollars shipped to my house in less than a week yeah there was modifications need to be done but god it sounds so much better so check that link out down below make sure you smash that like button comment got any questions just holler at me um, hit the subscribe button and turn your post notifications on that way you know when I post and I upload a video with that being said guys <laughs> I'm a happy person you guys dream big just like I am we'll see you